Welcome back to Age of Wonders 4, where we are trying to get that Master of Evilness achievement. And, well, we are besieged by regenerating infestations. We are in two wars, which aren't too much of an issue because our enemies are far, far away from us and they haven't actually ever reached us. Well, except uh, the white lady here. Sundran of Oz Ineo uh, has come, but we have repelled her poultry attempts. Uh, so right now we're just kind of keeping our troops at home, centered, sort of, and we try and react to infestations as they enter our realm with our very own frog home front defense force. And... Apart from that, we're just kind of sitting around defending our stuff. So these guys are put in position. These guys still are in position. You can stay in position and we'll just keep turning. We do have some ready of the lieges options. Maybe we reinforce one of our vassals around here. So they maybe they start cleaning up these things. But I don't even know if they do or if they're like mentally capable of doing so. I will eventually send someone out to try, uh, but for the moment, homeland stability is a little bit more crucial. So we'll just fight whatever comes up. And hope for the very best with that. Uh, these guys can go there. Our seat of chaos has been occupied. Yeah, I'm aware. Let's bring in the reinforcements for our main leader here. So you can take care of all this silliness. We just auto battle our way through. Make sure that no one takes our stuff. And they don't need orders. They need hugs is what they need. All right, we got a big burning dog and a small burning dog will put the big burning dog there and the small burning dog will put up on that army and just kind of spreading around a bunch of reinforcements in places to make sure we are ready i think this selection of soldiers will be what we send out uh to our outpost here to start taking care of some of those nests because the northern border region has been the safest and so we will simply do that. Everyone else just stays where they are. We will try and build some things. Ideally things that make some sense. Some boost in happiness and some money income. We don't... Well, we can always need things, but getting things is a different story altogether. They could use another person on their roster there. Let's get um a, a chaos eater and um, let's buy some small cheap stuff to reinforce our allies we'll give it to wall let's do the leveling up here this is our archer we're not going to take any of the feudal lords options there. Since they don't govern a city, instead we'll just upgrade them best we can. The weapon is a little bit glitchy, as you can tell. But I assure you it works. Alright, let's turn so we can start sending our soldiers to take care of these infestations. Though I'm pretty sure that one of these is going to come up to us anyway. Just wait for us to be in position. I do want to keep an uh, eye up north from time to time because, as I said, white has come down south before. And I am not trusting they wouldn't do so again. And there's always the threat of blue sitting behind our lines, slightly behind our lines. But that's okay. Uh, right, let's take care of what's creeping up to us here. We'll have to be slightly careful with dealing with these. 
uh, 1000 together they can do that so let's bring it up and attack the nest just clear this thing out we lost two units but I think we got well we got one of them back oh finally we got a staff of blossoms I've been waiting for a good new uh, support staff well, we actually did get two units back, so into the army they go. And we'll push ourselves to sit in our own territory for the turn end so we can regenerate and don't get, you know, taken out standing out there. All right, a root of order was built by white. Doesn't matter too much to us. Let's join these two armies. Let's join these two armies. Let's put them here together. They'll just stay there. You can stay there. You can stay there. You stay. You stay. You stay. You stay. I know I could just tell them to stay indefinitely, but I'd like to be reminded that they exist cycling through each turn. So I do it that way. Uh, let's give them a bathhouse. They're kind of unhappy up here. Not sure why. Looks like a fantastic place to me. All right, a level 15. What do we have? This is a support boy. Nature's Avenger. All friendly animals and plants. Meh. Meh, maybe. Let's do it. We got it. Might as well use it. Another hero leveled up. Uh, you get... He has a lot of options, but I just kind of like them be defensible. So, that's fine. New Empire development skills. Oh, yeah. What's that? Destroying an infestation or conquering... A yeah, we're destroying a lot of those. So let's get the uh, relationship bonus that we can get there. You want what? You want 12 gold and you're going to give us 100 mana. I'll give it to you as a gift. I don't have much, but you are friends. So we'll take it. Other rulers started a war. Nothing that concerns us. Ah, uh, right, all right, all right, all right. So we're, we're building toward getting the Heart of Chaos done. Once that is done, we will start the countdown to getting our victory in. We might want to do an Overlord's Tower in this city as well. Let's abandon this project and just do this because they are supremely unhappy zero city structures that help that <laughs> nothing i've never had a province broken off but i doubt it's it's great automain has been invaded okay yeah this is a <sighs> of course they come from the north this is a raiding party we'll deal with them next turn potentially Depending on what they're doing, basically. I, I want to make sure we get some more infestations done. Like this haunted graveyard has been there forever. But first, we are attacked. And we're actually not quite that strong anymore there. But we managed to survive it barely. A lot of things almost died. But almost isn't actually dead. Alright, we annexed a new quarry. Getting us a lovely new unicorn. Which we'll bring in. Uh, there are new infestations there. So let's use this army. Which we're not going to bring. To fight the other one. To waste the movement points there. We lost the level 1 unit. But uh, that's okay. It's in that army anyway. Let's bring these two north. To face off against this. It'll attack us anyway. Alright. What else do we have? Let's have a quick look around. Right, okay, they're starting to destroy our stuff, so I think we'll get on our ruler. Give them the cool new staff that we got. The Staff of Blossoms. And we'll send him north to this demon gate with one army, since it's pretty quiet down currently. This will be fine. 
we can just sit these here and hopefully that's gonna work these guys healed up a little bit but not enough so we'll just keep them on um, on this territory for the moment so they can heal up a little bit more a hero leveled up yeah that's good oh he's a level 15 I think I knew that but I didn't do that so reckless rage summon elemental summon animal he summons an animal we have so many animal related buff things already a truce has expired that's fine infestations are sending their people from down here we're working on it we're working on it the hinterland cleanup crew all right next turn gives us the heart of chaos up here and a demon gate down there i believe so that way we can start the countdown to winning and hopefully getting our achievement now 15 turns is longer than it sounds at such a state in the game especially if you throw in a combat a battle or two that you actually do Ooh, mark of the butcher minus 10 alignment units of this range fern cities lose two stability for each two pop okay well we'll do that do we um uh. oh man yeah we'll take the mark of the butcher uh bathhouse is coming so that'll help uh the heart of chaos was built so the overlord's tower is coming that'll help too uh, we definitely need uh do we have an overlord's tower already here where do i see what's already built there i think structures do we have an overlord's tower I don't think we do. What do we need to do to get one? This. This is what we need. This will... Is it? <laughs> is that what we need? I'm not even so sure. Should build the Smiths Guild, probably. <laughs> I'm not doing great with Shadow. I, I don't like playing Shadow. I really don't. I like my people being happy, you know? Or at least being able to do something about it. Overlord's Tower. Yeah, I can't afford it right now. It's fine. Would take a long time anyway. Yes, we have built the Heart of Chaos. So we can now go ahead and start on... Where is it? The Age of Chaos. Alright, so Blue has started a war with us immediately, basically. Uh, it was slightly foreseeable. Okay, I think we'll bring these boys back to defend the home front. Well, they're close to that, so think we can stay a little bit longer but this is pretty dangerous hmm nah we'll bring him home there's gonna be so many things and creatures coming for us now we'll bring them home we will bring them home in various places but we'll bring them home regardless and these ones can go up here. So let us go take care of this. Our ruler needs some practice too. Oh, that was enough for a level up. Very good. And we got a whole bunch of resources out of that. I'm not even sure why. Why so many? I know we get some, but that was a lot that we got there crazy that means we can start building that tower <laughs> all right we'll go with nature's avenger and we can build the overlord's tower here now 
or we can start on building that. Nope. Still not enough, but I can build the Overlord's Tower in the back here. I think that's a prerequisite, but it doesn't tell that it's unlocking that, which I find odd because generally they do. Okay, we have cast the last spell for a magic victory. We just need to achieve it, which could be more difficult to do than to be said. See, we didn't get nearly as much out of that battle. All right. Okay. You don't need any of these anymore. And you guys also leveled up, so let's get you, you're an archer, right? Let's get you eagle-eyed, bit more range, bit more hit. Uh, we're just setting various armies around to secure all that stuff. All right, we could summon Horned God now. Let's go for Unleash the Beast. It's pretty strong. It's pretty strong. But you have to have the, the creature properly positioned because otherwise it'll attack your stuff too. And that's not ideal. Gremlin un ambushes. I think we give that to each of our cities now. We can afford it. And I might forget to summon them. So, that's not ideal. You need them. You want to have them there already in place. They help. They help. Up to five gremlins join us in battle. And I'm fine with spending the mana. Just so our places are secure. Can I put that on an outpost too? It, it does say city, but... Uh, okay, not valid. So we'll... Oh, yes, cancel it, please. And I think we're gonna summon ourselves a horned god. Alright, we captured her. Does she have anything cool? Not really. Trade proposal from whom? Wizard Bond? Sure. You are probably working yourself up to a... To an alliance with us. An infestation is sending forces. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we cleaned out a whole one infestation. We did that. It's not like we're doing nothing. <laughs> so our northern border is fairly well defended. We, we got our vassal. We got our... Our boys here from Eshval. Uh, you know what we're going to do? We're going to take this burning dog, put it there, and we're going to take this big wolf boy into our main army. Because that thing is strong as heck. And we'll just stay right here on the demon gate, ready to move wherever we need to go. Oh, I don't know, we might actually want to go south immediately. Because there's really just a fairly weak army sitting there, so... Oh, we got these two, but, you know, now that blue is in the picture, looking to do some stuff. Speaking of looking to do some stuff, we're going to build ourselves a few uh, Outriders. A few scouts. You're going to see why in a little bit. All right, you're sitting on the Heart of Chaos, and you can come, I don't know, reinforce in the south. You just sit right atop the demon gate. Oh, no. Uh, no, 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 no. You go here next to the heart of chaos. This is where you are. 
you actually do stay here indefinitely. You stay there indefinitely too. You stay indefinitely too. Now we can start putting people down indefinitely as I don't have any plans of moving them. All right, what do we do next? Awaken instincts. All your units. 15 temporary hit points, that's a lot. All my units regain... What? Okay, well, berserk for two uh, rounds. That's uh, uh, That can backfire. That's all I'm going to say. That can backfire. Uh, we're going to get the mine here. Get that money in. And the spirit wolf will join this army over there. And we'll summon the horned god. Where do you summon the horned god? No one here has any spare room in their army, so we're just going to summon it here. And switch around a little bit. We'll take this out, put that in. And this thing, we'll just, I don't know, we'll put it back in our city or something. Empire development skill available, sure. What could we do? All units gain universal camouflage in our domain. Ah, yes, please. That's a good one. And all we hear, our heroes get one rank instantly is also pretty damn good. I think we'll do that. Oh, what's coming up? Armies regenerate in hostile terrain. No, we don't need that. Infinite sensing range. We're still far away from that, so I think we'll have the Imperium for that until then. So now we have a whole lot of leveling up to do. Making our boys stronger. Alright, let's give him a little bit more battle magic. Stuff. Visions of woe. Summon animal. He's a summoner. He can summon an elemental and an animal. He does all that stuff. Our leader is level 17 now. Let's give him vigor too. More health. Let's get all of our other heroes. Level 10. Good stuff. You will get the martial expertise. And we'll give you rallying blessing. All right, level nine, 18, man. You have been so good to us. Have done so much for us. Battle seeker training. Mm. Nah. Nah. True sight. Let's take restore. Removing negative status effects can be quite efficient. Quite helpful. So you are kind of here. Um, let's give you defense three. Just because you're pretty close to it anyway. Trade proposal. A defensive pact. Who knew? That's where we, <laughs> that's where we would be going. Other rulers are making defensive pacts. This message received. Alright. You like us for summoning stuff. Alright, you two some, uh, did an alliance. You are already allied with us, so that's good. Let's keep going. I think around turn five of this, um, summonings, invaders will happen. Where they come and try and take our stuff. And we'll have to keep a lookout on our borders. There. The first enemies are rearing their ugly heads. How's the north looking? I don't see anything coming our way yet. But the south is stirring. So let's uh, combine these armies here. Or rather, no, not these. And we'll send our scouts down there. They'll just sit there for the moment. And we'll send these boys down here. There's some stuff to combine. All right, and we'll just keep our troops nice and bunched up here. 
We'll see what comes. It might be their whole army. Might be nothing. I'm not going to leave any entirely undefended without heroes, meaning. Uh, but I think we can send these south as well. So they can join that army. Whoosh. Summoned in. You stay. You stay. And they don't necessarily know where we are. Oh, you want an alliance. I am so very surprised, but you can have that. You want a truce? Honestly, I'm, I'll give it to you. Uh, oh, wait. You want Gneissen from us. Always read these carefully. Uh, no, you don't get Gneissen from us. Let's go. I can't ask you to make peace. But I'm not giving you my city. All right, more alliances being forged in the background. And already newly forged packs are immediately being broken. Yeah, yeah denounce me all you want. I don't care. And infestations are still sending forces. I mean, this might just be an infestation that we're sensing at the border here. I hope the red glow goes away in soon. Makes the map a little bit harder to read, I believe. But I think after a few turns, they kind of go away. Those overlays. It's a nice little atmospheric trick, but I think the effect is just a little bit too strong. Especially if it's a color that you don't necessarily like. You know? So. Alright, so what am I doing with these boys? Um, I'm going to be annoying. That's what I'm going to be. So we'll send that here. We're going to go in here. We're going to go for pillaging a province. Takes less turns and gives us more. We're going to click out of this. Click into this. Click onto that. And we'll do that. This will chip away on our alignment. But that's okay. Alright. First invader spawned. That's not a problem, I don't think. Ooh, okay. Uh, that's actually quite hard. That's quite a lot. So we'll bring in these boys. Make it a little bit easier on us. We're still going to lose a bunch, but... Well, only lost one. Two. That's okay. We got one back. Let's move these up a little bit. There, and these boys we want to harass the enemy. I'm actually going to buy some more outriders here to do more harassing. Now let's look in our main city. We want to build this and then we can build the Overlord's Tower to try and help all that stuff. Where we are a little bit worried about provinces breaking away, you know. Yeah. You stay. It's nothing down here, but it just, you know, you never know when it comes. You guys stay. Awaken Instincts is done. What is next? Research for us. Create a forest or destructive growth. Targen's province is destroyed. Units within get some damage. I don't like these necessarily, but, you know. Let's build a Bastion's barricade up here. Make it a little bit stronger. Defensive Pact, Alliance, good. All our allies, I think, are allied amongst one another now. So we're basically facing a coalition of three enemies. One of which, namely Blue, we haven't really seen in action. Uh, but they sit down there. They exist. They sit over here with their capital city. So they might even come by sea or something. But I think we have enough room and space to get early warnings when and if they come. We'll just keep going in here, taking his stuff. I don't even know if they can see us while we do that, honestly. I, I don't know because from my end, it looks like they can't if they have this eye symbol. So to them, they're just losing provinces, basically. 
Uh, let's get the other scout also somewhere, no? Not there. Uh, that direction. So the infestations aren't coming for us directly anymore because I don't think they can see us either. Which is fine. They, they can just trundle around in our affairs. I don't mind that much. Could of course send someone to take care of it, but why should we? You guys just stand there. Another trade proposal has been received. No, I'm not giving you my city. I'm just... No. Why would you ever think I would do that? <laughs> Complimented. Thanks. Negotiation succeeded. More alliances. All good, all fine. We keep pushing forward. Next infestation or invasion is going to be coming up soon, I think. They're usually sooner than you would have liked. Okay, Dream Vault isn't actually his own. It's just a vassal city, so they're not going to come. So we can just harass them. Earn some money down here, basically. Slumber Spores. Ooh. Yeah. Deploy the spores throughout Gloom Hollow. Absolutely. We want that stability. I will take that stability. Alright, just keep taking your stuff if you're not stopping me. There's an enemy right there, so let's take ourselves some experience points here. If they come so nice and close, we won't mind. And you just sit there, you go to that army. I'm awaiting the next invasion, that's why I'm not really doing all that much more in terms of troop movement. You don't need any orders, you sit there. Your orders are to sit there. And your orders are to take this. Um, <laughs> what should we do? Summon a Baylor. Nah. I don't like those, honestly. But we could summon ourselves a greater animal. Tier 3. Mm, nah. We don't need it right now. Changed to good. Doesn't matter much. I don't like how we built our kingdom. That's just a long, tubular kingdom. That's... I like more boxy, square or round kingdoms. Generally, it's at least a, a much easier to traverse. This way is... A little bit difficult to maintain and defend. Invaders have spawned. Alright, they're here. So let's bring in our heroes. So we have all our heroes in the battle. All right, um, and we got a bunch of units out of it, so we'll just send these there onto that army. Invaders are done. These guys can walk, so they go there. You don't need orders. You don't need orders either. What do we do with you? I think we'll pull you out and send you out on the sea. Take some fisheries. And you will put... I don't know. Also out to sea. Take some fisheries. Alright. Tome of Paradise. What do we take? What options do we have? Man, let's take the Tome of Paradise. We're the highest here. So we can't have another major transformation. We already have the demonic thing. 
to spread across the world. Unfurl its emerald embrace over all. I mean, this is pretty strong. This is pretty damn strong. 90% chance on all enemies for distracted. That's crazy. We'll take this. That's pretty damn good. Um, yes, yes. I am absolutely worthy of a friend to you. I've been so good. I, I accepted your... Surrender. Very gracefully so. Very, very gracefully. You should be lucky I did that. Indeed. Bow. <laughs> be, be thankful. Alright, opponents are moving. Just scanning the horizon, really. Making sure we're not missing anything. But soonish we'll get this here. And then we won't have any guesswork anymore. Alright, you just keep going. Your orders stand, your orders stand too. You guys go in there, you guys go in there. And you guys miss the mark and go in there. I'll just bring these a little bit closer together. You stand there as well. What can we build here? Shrine. Uh, maybe this. Production conversions convert an additional 10% income. Doesn't sound bad. What could we do? Gardens of Bliss. I mean, sure. Maybe they will take care of this thing. What? <laughs> I don't think so. Uh, infestation sending more forces. I don't care. Let's reinforce some of our vassals with some money. We have some at the moment, so... Let's see. Uh, we'll give it to... to Ashwall. They are... Or are they here, I think. Yeah, let's give them a little bit more power. Northern borders need to stand and be secured. There will be more infestations, make no mistake. And the... The Wild East is just entirely untamed. Nothing to be done about that. I'm expecting the enemy to arrive at some point. Like they're not They're not just going to let me do this. I'm fairly certain. Stay, stay, stay. Yeah, I know you can annex something new, but you just have no space. You're too small. And we got this here. Movement for friendly units in your domain is reduced by minus two. Yes, we will absolutely take that. Right now, where we need to move in our domain and our domain almost exclusively. It's very sensible. Uh, Dark Knight, Bastion, Autumn, Summer, Spring. And what do we add last to this nice little army? Support, Mage, Chalk, Halberd. Yeah, let's give them a polearm unit. I'll just put these in our main city. Just so we got another little army hopping around. Helping us defend the place. Did they infest in did one of the infestation leave again? I didn't take care of it. Or did our ally? Oh, 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 more infestation movement. 
fine with that. Invaders spawned. Where? There. Okay. Can we fight them like this? I would have been surprised. So we we'll bring in the unicorn. And that should do it. With some losses, probably. We actually get the imp reinforcements out in the same domain, too. That's pretty cool. Oh, no, we lost the unicorn. No. Not the unicorn. But we got a gremlin out of it, so... That's something. To see, people. And you just stay. You camp. Camp. Stay. 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 Um, Glade Runners. Inferno. We do. We deal extra damage against burning stuff, so... The raiding party might be the only army that we're going to see besides the invasions. I'm not entirely sure where nothing is coming. Like, this is normal difficulty. As far as I'm aware. I haven't dared play higher yet because I don't feel confident enough in my skills, especially early and mid-game. Oh, oh, oh. There are some armies. Might they come south? What is this? A swamp troll? <laughs> That's cool. Who are you? What do you want? Um. All right. Sure. Enjoy. I don't. I don't care what happens in Hollow. Okay, magic victory in five turns. We're not going to do any orders because I don't see anything worth ordering around. We don't need to integrate nothing. Uh, though we could use the Whispering Stone and throw it at our own city here. To help a little bit with the uh, happiness. Free city can be in integrated. Infestations have invaded. Yeah. I don't care, unless they directly come for my stuff. Uh, let's take the small monster then, though. That's definitely not something we want to have sitting here. Plus, who knows what might be in there. You know, a bright life drinker. We already have that sword, which I love. It's definitely one of my favorite weapons in this game. That I've found so far, anyway. It's probably cooler stuff, still. All right, time to raid some fisheries. And you guys just, well, no, actually you don't stay there. There's a giant bird nest. Uh, we'll send our leader alone, I think. Well, almost alone. Yeah, that's another level up, nice. A storm orb. Not bad. The Gortusk Piglet is one of those units. It's certainly one of those units. It exists. I will send it north. It'll reinforce our northern border. Absolutely it will. <laughs> Alright, there's our new army, which will just sit down right here. That's where they're gonna stay. And what level up shall we do? Oh, Vigor 3 or Inspiring Icon. The city of the Sierra... Oh, yeah. Here starts back. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's an Inspiring Icon for sure. For sure is what he is. More morale in the, in the main city. Definitely gonna take that. Okay, morale from the city goes down if we have enemies sitting in our realm. Makes sense. Makes sense. I think there's even a thing that you can get where that is reduced or even removed entirely. Opponents are still moving. Independents are moving. Just four more turns and we should have done it. Can we do it today? 15 minutes left to an hour in this very 
recording. I wonder. Oh no, did I break the game? Nope. <laughs> Just clicked slightly too early. Um, I don't see no invasion. So we can likely just... Ah, oh, let's go. Get another fishery. And these I want to send south. I want to learn what's happening here. Just in case they ever send something. I want to know early. You don't need orders. You don't need orders. You don't need orders. This is nice. Um, Incite Rebellion is fun. Doesn't help us. Oh, yeah. Sustain city uh, spell. Let's get more defense on our stuff. All right. You were complimented and complimented. Invasion from those things. I don't see anything coming our way from any of the other empires. They know what we have. They have resigned to their fate. Honestly, the fact that they're not sending anything out to take out my scout makes me think they don't know we are here. But I can't believe that because the city has a sensing and seeing range. At that... I still haven't put anything to see. That's just a little bit weird. Just a little bit odd. All right, there's the next invasion. Um, we are going to send one of our heroes north to help. I think they can use the experience for sure. Lost a level two unit and everyone leveled up. Goodness. I actually never had a level 20 uh, hero, I don't think. Uh, you joined on here. And uh, let's level everyone up. You are a warfare guy. Let's get you sentinel because that's kind of what you do. I'm so proud of you. You've done so such great things. Uh, let's get you strength training. Yeah, let's make your units stronger. Invaders have spawned. Oh yeah, I took care of them already. How forgetful of me. All right, nothing here. All right, let's get you down south. I will definitely go and raid that while I wait. Might as well make some money. Make sure we don't have any good alignment, just in case that means something. In terms of not being able to, you know, get this achievement. All right, Overlord's Tower is done. Now let's build this. Give them a little bit more happiness. In the end, we can annex another province. What shall we take? Do we see money anywhere? Well, we see mana. We're, we're kind of short on that, so we'll take this lovely little mana node right there. And we got a unicorn out of it. I sure like my unicorns. Where could we put our unicorn? Up to the northern defense force. And you get... Flame burst weapons. Yeah, yeah. Send your invading forces. I'm fine with that. Why do we keep jumping down? That confuses me. All right, let's set these to burn those fisheries. And these, hopefully, yep, to burn those fisheries. And you keep going north. To join that army. No invasion force. 
so we can can stay where they are let's brr. catapult towers yeah for sure more defensive stuff I don't think we need it but eh. trade proposal what do you want open borders uh, sure give me money you can have that and we'll go into the next turn. Oh, <laughs> okay. Uh, they definitely can't see us. And there they are taking us out in force. What do we have? Some heavy hitters, no very high level uh, heroes, so I'm not too scared if they dare show their faces. So we'll just keep taking this thing apart then. But they're never going to reach us in time. We'll never have to fight them. And isn't that what all true wars are about? Winning without ever fighting once. Alright, let's take the harbor. Ah, uh, we got there. That's an invasion force. Raiding party. Um... Do we do something about those? Do we send something or someone? I think we'll send her. She has a great track record. She gets one of the Northern armies as a support. And next turn we'll take care of that. Yes, Fortress of Wines, we want that. Nature's Bounty. Yeah. That's not bad. Let's get that. Another province for annexation. Can we get something cool? Ooh, the Banalus Keep. Now, now, after only almost a hundred turn or something, we finally get that thing, <laughs> and we get a little spider out of it, which we will also send north to reinforce that weird little army there. Okay, we're evil now. That's okay. Dream Vault has sent a war party. I think those are in the south. So right, let's end our turn. Next turn we win anyway. Or at least we should. If we don't actually win on this turn, I'm not I'm not entirely sure. But as you can see this just Nothing whatsoever that's going to be even close to attacking us. Where they need to attack us. And then win too. So. And there we go. Ooh, we got the achievement. Master of Evilness. We did it. Fantastic stuff. Finally. Yes. Age of Chaos. Our people watch in awe as we stride forth, leaving madness and destruction in our wake. A red dawn shines upon the realm as we call forth the Age of Chaos. Well done, Lord of Chaos. Alright, so this is our journey. Uh, we started out with just our little city here. We expanded Circular. This was our first new city. Then up there, that was integration, our vassal. We absorbed them. More growing, slowly, slowly growing. I think somewhere around here, a war start. Yes, yellow declared war. We took his city and another city <laughs> and another city, which we then subsequently all released as vassals. I think here around there, he became our vassal. So he stabilized again. And that's really the major war event that happened. 
Uh, we could go for military ranking and see some more events right there. I think this is where white reached our borders and we smacked them back into the Dark Ages. And yeah, we, we, we were fairly powerful for a good long while, so I think we did great. Though I was very stressed about the infestations. Now, uh, do we let him ascend Arctus the Ruined? Yes, he shall ascend and become a hero of our people. And we get Pantheon points. Wow, look at that. Six points. We're level 51 Pantheon. Uh, does that unlock all that still needs unlocking? It, it just might. We have five things to unlock left. So let's do it together, gang. We get the mask and the thing and the thing and that. And that's that. We've unlocked everything. Amazing. Uh... Sadly, there's there doesn't seem to be a thing. Also, I think I realized a ruler can't come and help you, but they might come out as an enemy faction. A hero might come and offer their services to you. I think that's the difference between a hero and a ruler here. So, yeah, just, you know, keep that in mind. Our very first uh, victory is our ruler. And, oh, we're done with the progression done and done i hope you enjoyed this i certainly did despite the stress in between and if you did leave a like leave a comment and i hope i see you around the next thing until then bye bye